Hey guys, thank you for watching and supporting the channel. I'm gonna hop right Where into it because five minutes is, a, is not enough Brilliant. time to rant about EA and the fact that EA's oh, hockey oh, league is too. not in next gen versions of the game. They dropped on Tuesday night that they said uh, NHL 15 will not have EA Sports Hockey League and that they will be getting OTP later. The fact that they're getting a game mode after release shows that EA couldn't get everything they wanted in this game done and uh, they don't they can't push the game back because say hypothetically they push the game back till October no or let's say November right we'll say November so they got to get back to that September you no know, drop at some point so they'll have a 10 month window for NHL 15 that would never happen so instead of getting to push the game back you're buying a, a game that has is lacking in modes there's no real definitive version of this game where it's like in a Battlefield 4 for next gen. Granted, it's broken and it's got its own problems. Uh, it is the definitive version on next gen. It has 64 players online, it's better graphics, all that, the whole nine yards. Whereas NHL 15 is definitely bipolar uh, in comparison. Uh, so yeah, and all the modes are still intact for NHL 15, and it might look inside. a little better than 14, but there's really not much you can do with the 360 and PS3 anymore. The systems are 7 and 8 years old. Uh, yeah, actually 8 and... Yeah, they're going on 8 and 9 years old now. Or 10, it's getting, they're getting old. They're really old. You can't do much for graphics with those systems, so don't expect NHL 15 to look much better if you're getting it for 360 or PS3. Uh, so... Then you got the next gen version, which you know, arenas will look great. I'm hoping. Well, the god, if they put them in there, and above EA Sports Hockey League, they better look fucking pristine. Must be with the and then the graphics it's look good. Um, so yeah, that's great. Magic. But there's like no modes to play. Uh, it would it would be like getting a next gen Call of Duty. You could only do maybe free for all, and which is still more than NHL 15 because free for all would imply at least six players. Uh, the fact that the only online game modes are two-player, and of course they get hot in their hockey ultimate team over EA Sports Hockey League. Why? Because there there is more money, and I, I mean Johnny Superman said, "Oh, you know that's we're just talking about. You know, they didn't put it in there solely just for the money. They do make a significant more money off of EA Sports Hockey. League. Let's not you know sugarcoat it." Oh my god, we know that they make a, a killing off that. There's people that it's love to buy the money, or to buy the stuff. And all those microtransactions. Whereas in EA Sports Hockey League, there are not as many microtransactions. There's the uh, faction and whatnot, which you only can help you for so, so long. And not many people buy more than one or two. If you buy more than one or two boost packs, you're really wasting your money. Not to say that buying one isn't a waste of money, too. It, it is. They, like I said, they don't make as much money as they do in Hut, so they're going to be pushing Hut. And honestly, I was planning on giving Hut a chance oh, this year, Hockey Ultimate team, but with the exclusion of EA Sports Hockey League, with the fact that they went dark on us, fans were asking week after week after day after day, hour after hour, hey, yes or no, is this mode in the game? And they just could not respond to us. Big fuck you to the community that spends $60 a year on your roster update. So... I have a right to be upset. I mean, I I was expecting this for a little while, so I'm more just like disheartened. You know, I guess that's the best way to put it. I'm not really angry, but I mean, speaking for the community, because I, I know I, I watched a few of the other other guys who post videos on this subject, like Johnny Superman, who he does good videos. Not, nothing against the guy. Uh, you know, picking up grammar and saying that he's a fan of the game, and that that's true. But at the same time, you know, we're the we're the consumer. We you know. Uh, we wanted the mode in the game, and they screwed us. They gave us no. They, they gave us no heads up. They, they should have got a hold of us six months ago. Hey fans, making the jump to next gen. What modes do we have to have next gen? EA Sports Hockey League should have been number one. I maybe online versus and or a GM or play now. Or the fact that there's a that was thrown over the bus uh, and left out this year is a joke. It's really sad. The NHL 15 for last year looks like a strict roster update um, besides the announcer change. Much needed, yes, but at the same time take our favorite mode out and you expect us to be happy about it. I really do hope these people on Twitter that are saying that they're not going to buy the game live up to that let's speak with our wallets here. If you don't want to buy the game, if you're disappointed, then don't. All right, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Everyone have a great weekend. Take care.